it's summertime. Most of us have all of our favorite sports are on hiatus and ramping up, and there's nothing to talk poolside or water cooler about. So what do you do? You start looking out into the future and deciding who's going to win how many games. And for some of us, like that guy over there, you may or may not be getting ready for a plane trip to Vegas. So we're going to have some fun today and talk overs and unders. And the source of the site that I'm using as the line for at least college and NFL folks is the Vegas Insider website. So we're going to use that as the source, have a little fun with it. All right, another big one that's going to be fun to talk about. Florida State, their line is a, a flat 10. <laughs> Oh, man. The Florida State one is tough. I've been looking at them. Uh, they, I, I was really hoping they would come in at nine because I do think they're going to win 10 games this season. I have them going exactly 10 and two. That's, and, and I'm right there with you. So getting that extra win. I don't see it. I don't either. But they're going to go to a bowl game. So with the college football lines, that includes the bowl games, too. Uh, and then also the a ACC championship is now just a straight 1-14. One one it's no longer Atlantic and Coastal. So with you talking your logic through it, I'm now on board of getting to that, uh, uh, that half a win above it. And, and I think – Put them at 13 games. Yeah, I think they can I think they can do that. All right, folks. There you have it. There is our team by team overs and unders projections in early July for you to make your future bets on. If you win because of us, we'll gladly take a percentage of your money. If you lose because of us, hey, that was free advice the internet gave you. Shame on you for listening to us. So there you have it. Comment below. Don't forget to like and to subscribe. You can visit our website, coachingcrewshow.com, on a regular basis and see how we do throughout the season. Thanks for watching.